Ranking top Democrat caught in major corrupt move. He should resign. Yet another Democrat politician has become embroiled in a scandal. The Daily Caller reports that the chief of staff to Democrat Representative Bernie Thompson was indicted for providing false information on a form designed to give him top secret clearance. In a bizarre move, Representative Thompson has stated that he will not fire his chief of staff. Isaac Lanier Avant, Thompson's chief staff, earned $170,000 per year in congressional pay. However, the authorities have found that he did not pay any tax returns for seven years and did not have tax deducted, taxes deducted from his paycheck. According to prosecutors, Avant was dishonest throughout the course of the investigation. When he finally files his returns, he falsely claimed that he donated $50,000 to a religious organization. Avant was sentenced to a month-long jail term and a year of weekends in jail. Between 2008 and 2012, Avant had no federal income taxes withheld from his paychecks. The Department of Justice released a statement that reads, he caused a form to be filed with his employer that falsely claimed that he was exempt from federal income taxes. Only eight months into his weekends in uh, jail sentence, uh, a grand jury indicted Avant on more charges. They alleged that he only paid taxes in order to obtain a top secret clearance when he served on the Committee on Homeland Security. Thompson refused to fire the staffer for this accusation as well. He charged, uh, he's charged, and if he's proven to be guilty, then obviously that would be the result. But I'm not going to fire him now because he hasn't had his day in court, Thompson said in August of last year. Shortly after, Avant pleaded guilty to the charges, but Thompson still kept him on staff. He was still receiving pay at the time. In 2013, while applying for the position in Homeland Security, he claimed he had filed his taxes when he really hadn't. If he is convicted of these charges, he could face up to five years in prison. Avant's cavalier attitude towards his legal de uh, duty to file and pay taxes, which extended from 2005 to the time he was interviewed by a federal agent in 2015, it's astonishing, prosecutors stated. The extremely limited written statement Avant uh, submitted to the U.S. probation officer as to his acceptance of responsibility is further evidence of this concert, uh, disconcerting view of the seriousness of tax, his tax fraud. Of course, Avant did have an excuse for refusing to pay his taxes. He claimed that he could not afford the rent on his apartment. This situation is another example of the rampant corruption plaguing the Democratic Party. Over the past few months, we have seen numerous Democratic politicians exposed for their involvement in both financial and sexual scandals. Of course, we know this type of behavior is present on both sides of the aisle, but lately, it seems to be an issue the Democrats are facing more than Republicans. Hopefully, the Justice Department will continue to crack down on corruption in the government. After all, President Trump did promise to drain the swamp, right? Well, that's the least, uh, that's the least of it, actually. Could be, uh, you know, more serious issues going on. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And again, thank you so much for watching.